and welcome to this webcast. In this webcast, I am going to demonstrate procure to pay process in D365 for finance and operations. My name is Ali Reza Zaidi. I am ERP consultant currently working for a business experts turf in the Middle East region. So procure to process consists of four steps, uh, five steps. Number one is creating a vendor, then creating purchase order for a vendor then receive the purchase order then invoice the purchase order and finally release the payment to purchase order so let's begin so first step i have to go to create a purchase order for this i i have to go procurement and sourcing module then vendors and click on all vendors here for my action pane i have to click on new button zero 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 three zero zero three and again i'm selecting a new name ali zedi and from a group i select parts vendor and from address book i am going to create warehouse of ali zedi and i'm going to select and it's automatically selected and Vendor address is created. We create the vendor. Now we have to go to set to important terms in payment. First step for a vendor. For this, we will go into payment section. Click on it. Payment first step, and here we set number one is payment uh, terms of payment. It's uh, there are multiple values. We will select net thirty that is appropriate for us and from here we will set the electronic payment and from top we will going to save and from procure tab click on purchase order new purchase order so form for a purchase order is open and from purchase order lines it automatically selected and here we going to select uh, m double double zero one item and and from left side i'm going to update the quantity to 10 and when i save it price is updated and from purchase order action pan so i'm going to con click on confirmation there is a printout setup there is, will be multiple options here and current date terms of payment and after verifying all these things we have to confirm the purchase order when we click on it click on ok so our purchase order is confirmed uh, it is a confirmed status now we are going to receive it and then invoice it for this we we have to go on action pen click on action pen receive click on and product receipt and we i'm going to enter three four three four one two as a product receipt number current print and posting and and after that click on ok so this is the our product received and product is successfully received is created now i'm going to create an invoice for this i click on invoice action pane and from here i click on invoice from invoice screen i set the invoice identification number 890 
and anything you can invest description you can enter here and after that i click on update match status so update match status is completed then i'm going to post the invoice so purchase invoice posting in process so message is advice is successfully posted uh, the vendor invoice posting process is completed for vendor be 0003 invoice 980 now we have to go and pay the invoice and then payments and vendor payment journal and create a new payment journal select here the name vendor pay and from click on our lines and voucher is automatically coming from i paste the vendor and theory from settle transaction the transaction already coming uh, select the market click on mark and click ok you can see 38 is coming in a debit side and any information you want to set you can do it and click on post so this operation is completed so this is the procure procure to pay process in d65 for finance and operation so this is the procure to payment process in d65 for finance and operation in this demonstration first i create a vendor then i create a purchase order then i receive the purchase order then i invoice the purchase order and finally create a vendor payment journal and settle transaction and post it so this is the process see you in another video for another d365 for finance and operation process demonstration or some interesting feature thank you for watching see you in another video